Hey guys, as always, it's the Digital Pumpkin Cat, and of course, today is my one-year channel anniversary, and I'm very happy to have 1K subscribers. I mean, I know I'm not quite there yet, but I consider me at 1K. 1,000 subscribers in a year is just great to have, and I'm so thankful for that. So consider this another anniversary special, because today... We will be comparing, or I guess versing, Spirit Halloween's Mr. Dark. Verse, one you probably never have heard before. The Spirit Halloween 2009 to 2014 online only. Drop Down Corpse. Um, I just, Drop Down Corpse is very un underrated. And I always loved Mr. Dark. Love both of these. Very similar, but yet so different because they're almost opposites in a way so it's great to um verse these and it's great to have like my first full verse video up on the channel for 1k subscribers slash anniversary special so let's go ahead and compare them <laughs> So you just saw both Mr. Dark's and Drop Down Corpse's video, the like one video on YouTube about him, and we're going to be comparing them now. Starting off with animation, Drop Down Corpse, uh, well of course he only does one thing, which is drop down, um, and you know, I think that's this is a really, really unique jump scare. Almost a hazardous jump scare. I mean, Mr. Dark is a really hazardous jump scare, too. We've had a lot of hazardous jump scares. I'm just saying this is a very hazardous jump scare in a way. Because, I mean, it might take out a few kids. But besides that, th again, this is really, really unique. Um, Like, we haven't had much of this at all. And I got applaud brick thunder for making those drop down clowns last year can't wait to see what he comes out with this year um so i guess it's that simple he drops down it's unique and a great jump scare so i guess we're done and i just really love it definitely a great scare so now in terms of audio i mean it's just zombie noises and that's it um, nothing much to talk about here. They're good zombie noises, but nothing's really a bad zombie noise in my opinion. And in terms of looks, unlike Mr. Dark, um, instead of just like a normal generic white color palette, he actually does have a corpse um, look, as the name suggests, drop down corpse. And I really do like that. It's like a fleshy, rotting head with some bones sticking out around the eyes. And then of course the hands are hands. But again, everything just looks decayed, and I love how the paint job looks, and it just all looks rotten and gross, and I really love how his face and stuff looks. So let's go to Mr. Dark and see what he's all about. Alright, so now on to Mr. Dark. And of course, starting off with the animation like we did with Drop Down Corpse. He is literally the exact opposite of Drop Down Corpse when it comes to animation, Everything else are almost identical, except for the paint job, of course, but um, that's why when Mr. Dark came out, it gave me so much nostalgia. Uh, but, like, Mr. Dark goes much, much faster and just a much bigger span than Drop Down Corpse. And I gotta say, even though, in my opinion, um, Drop Down Corpse is just, I guess, concept in terms of animation and animation in general is much more unique than just a simple big pop-up motion, I have to go Mr. Dark. I have to give the first point to Mr. Dark because I think Mr. Dark is just more effective and just more scarier when it comes to the animation. And now in terms of audio, um, Mr. Dark doesn't just growl and stuff. And I really do appreciate that. He actually says a for once creepy and scary phrase that has ever been said on a Reaper. 
And he says, I think, like, the Reaper calls in the dark of night. And I really like that. Really fits, of course, the name of Mr. Dark. And really fits his character and concept. I just really love the audio. And so that point has to go to Mr. Dark. And, yeah, I think it beats Zombie Grouse any day. Now the looks. In terms of looks, like I said, it's basically the same thing. The only thing we're comparing here is the hands and head. Now, the head is... I always found Mr. Dark's head really, really scary. With all those teeth, millions of teeth, his wide-open mouth, how his face expression is. It's like a generic, normal skull, but, like, pulled into a monstrous-type being, I guess. And I really do love how he did that. Um, The hands are normal hands, I just going to keep on saying it. And yeah, definitely a different head than uh, the corpse. Although, of course, painted white and stuff. And I do think um, drop down corpse's whole, you know, corpse look fits him better than just being a generic looking reaper, which I mean, Mr. Dark is. Um, And just the regular skull doesn't do as much justice as that gross corpse decaying look that we got on Drop Down Corpse. And again, hands are hands. So that means the last point of the day goes to Drop Down Corpse. But the winner, if you haven't guessed already and put two and two together, is Mr. Dark. Mr. Dark got two out of three points where Drop Down Corpse got one out of three points really fun to compare these guys definitely going to do more comparing and verse videos in general and definitely like and subscribe i really want 1k subscribers almost there i can taste it thank you guys so much for all of that thank you guys for one year of the digital pumpkin cat and thank you guys so much for sticking with me on these videos And I really appreciate you watching. So as always, Digital Pumpkin Cat and definitely more verse videos coming in the near future.